Well, today I'm working on a security job at an undisclosed location, but I wanted to test out a little stove that I got, you know, in case you don't want to run your truck all night when it's cold or uh, if you break down, help keep the cab warm. So what I'm going to have going on here is I got, uh, where is it? I got this uh, backwood stove. It's a little stove you hook onto the propane tank. And I'm figuring I can just have her down on the floor there, centered, passenger seat, passenger side, and uh, put it down very low and see if it'll keep the uh, cab warm. Okay, so I'll take the cap off the butane. Should go down there nice. Open up the little stove box. Just connects on here. Actually, I got a lighter, but I believe it's got its own sparker. Yeah, it's got its own spark. Can't really see it, but it's, it's there. Screw that on. And snug hand tight. Now, let's see if we can get it lit. Yeah, the trick with this, you can see the flame going there good, but the trick with it is uh, you got to barely turn the gas on. If you put it on too much, the sparker won't light it. Barely turn it on, so just a little bit of gas, light it, then turn it up. Left for more, and right for less. But there's a positive and a negative on the, um, on the knob here. And I have a thermostat or a thermometer. We're starting at uh, 11 degrees C. We'll give her 10 minutes, 10, 15 minutes and see what it warms up to. I'm just gonna keep it, keep it uh, pretty low. Cause you don't want to get too hot where you're gonna be burning something, right? We'll try it there, and we'll see in 10 minutes, just 15, and see uh, how warm it gets in the cab. Okay, 10 minutes when it's on low, and we're up to about uh, 25C, which is plenty warm enough. Now, I would suggest, you know, if you're using it... Uh, for emergency situation, if you break down the side of the road maybe, or and you gotta wait a significant amount of time, or you hit the ditch or big snowbank, definitely uh, very good for that. Now, of course, I'm not uh, endorsing it to use in your vehicle, because I cannot do that. It does come with nice instructions. You could even make in a pot of coffee while you're warming up your vehicle. And of course, all the, um, a lot of warnings, danger, carbon monoxide. But for me, I just uh, crack the window open a quarter inch. I have a portable carbon monoxide detector, a low oxygen detector. Once again, for emergency situations, or if you're just out and you want to make yourself some uh, something to eat, take this out and put it on the picnic table, or on your end gate, wherever. Very handy device. A bottle should last about eight hours if you keep it on low. Um, ultra light, 
packable. Throw it in a pack sack if you're going camping. It says you can boil boil time five minutes thirty seconds to boil water. Easy light. And then you attack attach directly to the uh, canister as you seen me do. So yeah, I think it's very good. Uh, I'll put a link in the description. If you have any uh, comments, please do comment. Let me know what you think. Catch you on the next one.